here I have a beat playing in loop mode. I uh, will listen to it. And the output goes... I just have to do like this, so... I don't need to set too much things. The output goes into the envelope follower. Envelope follower, follower output goes to a sequencer uh, here. And it's just every time it's catching a signal over the threshold, it sends a pulse which advances the sequence. Sequence output goes to FM input of MSV. And the signal from the sample player goes to the envelope follower, but it also goes to the exciter input of the MSV, which also goes to an input on my mixer so we can hear it and it sounds like this. It means it's the original sound going into the exciter. Now, these two outputs, they also go to my mixers. So the, what we hear now is the output, is the processed signal. So, as, so without CV going into the FM, if I don't send the CV from the sequencer into the FM, it sounds like this. And then it becomes interesting when we take the same sequence and send it to an input. So here, for instance, when a, high, a note is high, the brightness goes lower, so it's less brightness, etc. Every time a note goes high, we'll have a bit more, more damping. More or less, of course, but yeah. Thank mm -hmm. you. 